Caleb was making like a coco salmon cake or anything related to uh, generally just the Pacific Islands and I think that, that was just like missing um, so yeah I was like if if I can do it then that would be a good way to so sort of introduce people to salmon stuff without being so like I guess scary. Yeah. I think that can sometimes be what stops people from being interested in trying other cultures. I really loved looking at your shelf of ingredients back here <laughs> and seeing this entire shelf dedicated to coco samoa, you got your coconut cream here. Yeah. Is it a point of pride for you to be able to incorporate your heritage into your cake making? Yeah, growing up in like a, a Western society, it, it can be hard to be really proud about being different. Yeah, I guess I cry about it a bit because it's a bit embarrassing to think about, um, especially because like people like my generation now are very like 685 to the world, like it's very loud and proud. Yeah. And it just like wasn't a thing, like at least not in my immediate community of like Pacific Islanders. As I got older, it's just sort of realized like it's what makes me different. Yeah. And, like helps me stand out type of thing. And yeah, like I'm just really proud to be for sure. Yeah, like the culture's really rich, the food's really good, like what is there not to be proud of? Yeah. All like in the pressure. These look amazing. Don't know about the cake that I decorated, so let's Killed just, uh, yeah, not, uh, <laughs> not, not dwell on that. Um, but talk to me about the, the flavours of these different cakes. So this one is my Baifala flavour. Uh, so it's just a vanilla bean cake with a, uh, like the Baifala, the pineapple pie filling. Nice. So it's like a custard with pineapple in it. Wow, that pineapple was like really jumps out at you. That's yum. I'll be back in one second. Yeah. Grab something. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! That is insane. A little something I prepared earlier. Okay. <laughs> this is mine. Had to do it. Holy moly! I'm um I'm floor. <laughs> you know, I feel a little bit bad eating cake on camera in front of all these people who are going to be watching because I'm sorry I can't share this with you. Having flashbacks of palm trees and <laughs> being in the islands. <laughs> the warm, <laughs> yeah, humid air. Being yelled at by my grandma. No, nah, kidding. <laughs> and the flavor of this cake? Can so this one here is the sasalapa cake. Um, so it's a coconut cake with coconut and a sour soft swirled cheesecake. When I think of an idea or I think of a flavour combination that'll work, I'll try it once and then I'll feed it to my family and honestly if they say it's good then I'm just going to trust that it's good. Did you like speak to someone about my flavour preferences because <laughs> it's pretty accurate. <laughs> you read my mind. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that is incredible guys. Okay, get a look at that. 